I think we can uh, begin now. Um, my name is Odelia. Dear morning. Thank you for joining me uh, today. Um, in this presentation, what I would like to share with you is a collection of uh, European funding opportunities in the field of health and uh, life sciences uh, in general. Uh, the European Commission is engaged to enhance research, development and innovation, bringing us to a cutting edge medical knowledge and treatment. And uh, we are at, at uh, Argentum. We are here to enhance this. Uh, I represent Argentum, uh, which is a consulting firm uh, specializing in attaining European non-dilutive funding for SMEs, research institute, academic establishment in a variety of fields. But today we'll focus on the life science. What I would like to point at is our unique methodology that we have developed over the years. First of all, our team combines analysts, uh, project managers and grant writers that provide a securing and organized process, but also a step-by-step -step process targeting highest chances of success by a sub multi submission strategy and uh, an enriching journey, journey, but I will come back to this later. Let's drill down to the opportunities we bought here uh, in this uh, presentation today. Uh, first of all, uh, we will review the Horizon Europe opportunity. Horizon Europe um, uh, offers a palette of opportunities. Um, and as you know, Horizon Europe is the succeeding program after Horizon 2020. It's a seven year program, the most ambitious research and innovation investment program provided by the European Commission. Uh, then we'll review some bottom-up calls. When I say bottom-up, um, it's calls that are open to every uh, field of application, but are especially interesting for innovation in the field of life science. And I'll explain this uh, uh, later. I'll present also shortly a program called AAL that is targeting uh, innovative solution in the assisted living, uh, living and uh, aging domain. And finally, we will review some specific uh, research uh, uh, initiative, leveling uh, specific diseases or specific life science applications. So regarding uh, Horizon uh, Europe, even though not officially published yet, Horizon Europe will offer a 96 billion euro budget for the next seven years, beginning in 2021. Horizon Europe will include six clusters, six uh, topics, and one of them is the health program. And for the health program will be allocated 7.7 .7 billion euros. So this is a large uh, program. Currently, what we know is that um, se uh, dozens of calls would be, will be published uh, over uh, 2021 and 2022. And um, uh, those calls offered, uh, uh, are open to a large palette of topics uh, or called destination as appearing in, in uh, his, uh, this box on your uh, right. Usually those uh, calls are requiring a consortium application and most of them are research oriented, but also some of them uh, market oriented uh, that are inviting new products to market and new market uh, creation. So this was about the, the health cluster. Now, as I mentioned, the bottom up calls are uh, especially relevant to uh, the life science application because most of the funded project appears to be in the life uh, sciences domain. Uh, in the bottom-up calls, we have the EAC accelerator that is inviting independent companies uh, to apply, bringing up a new market, uh, new product to to the market in a period of two years. Uh, similarly, we have the fast track to innovation, also market oriented, but this time requiring a small consortium of three to five uh, partners. 
we have also the FET Open. FET Open is more research oriented and invites uh, radical innovation that are more early stage in uh, advancement. I wanted also to bring up some bilateral uh, calls that are also uh, bottom-up calls. Uh, bilateral calls are a national funding mechanism. It's not under the European Commission, uh, but it's inviting collaboration between two or more uh, uh, countries within the Eureka, uh, Eureka and Eurostars uh, uh, um, countries. Uh, as I said, we will uh, review shortly the EA AAL program, Advancing Inclusive Health and Care Solutions for Aging Well in the New Decades. Um, in, the next, uh, in the last uh, uh, week, 30 co uh, calls has been published for uh, May 2021. Th those calls are inviting a large collaborative project or small collaborative project. Each of the tracks uh, requires a certain uh, level of advancements in, ter in terms of uh, technology, require a, a small or larger consortium, and also invites for a, a, a smaller or larger uh, budget. The funding rate in this uh, um, program, uh, it depends on the country. Each country has its own funding rate that is ranging between 50% and 90%. It depends on the country, but also on the organ organization type. So it's a bit, a bit complicated, but we are here to, uh, to analyze this and uh, explain. Uh, within this program, we have 13 uh, uh, member countries. So if you're an organization that is part of those countries, you're eligible to uh, apply. And what I will also uh, uh, mention is that within those consortium in this program, it's very important to include uh, end users. For example, a medical institution or a social, uh, social ho uh, a home or uh, any end user uh, represented. Here on the yellow box, you can find the eight application areas that has been defined as the uh, area targeted by the uh, AAL program. As you see, uh, it covers uh, quite a lot of, uh, of topics. Um, so we will review together if your application uh, is eligible within those uh, areas. As I said, uh, 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 above of those uh, opportunity, we have some uh, specific uh, uh, initiative that are targeting uh, special um, diseases, for example, research uh, against uh, cancer or diabetes uh, or rare diseases. We have some uh, specific call targeting special uh, uh, field of application like the nanomedicines, uh, of course, obviously, but Someone, uh, somewhat unfortunately, uh, there are also calls targeting COVID-19, uh, uh, inviting solution uh, uh, targeting uh, uh, this uh, new disease and its uh, effects. So this is a bit uh, an overview of uh, the opportunities, large, more specific, inviting uh, uh, independent uh, uh, organization to apply or a consortium, inviting early stage project or more advanced project closer to market. The idea here would be to tailor your application. In order to do so, uh, we can go together defining exactly your research uh, uh, field, your innovation you want to, uh, to uh, enhance, but also at the, the organization or company uh, level would be to understand your objective, your ambitions, your inner strategy for the next years, what would be more interesting to you for you to do in the next year or after. And then according to uh, your inner strategy to in evaluate the um, the palette of opportunities we have uh, uh, reviewed to select the right call and uh, uh, also uh, select the right timing. Uh, 
Then when we have selected this, we will make a short evaluation of your chances of success regarding, uh, 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 for example, a previously funded project or regarding the competition of, uh, of this track. Then uh, uh, with all this uh, information, we can establish together a funding strategy plan. Uh, then, as soon as we are uh, agreed on the plan, we can execute the plan and prepare the proposal or the proposals. This step-by-step step, step uh, um, tailoring application, as explained, uh, is targeting multi-submission strategy because we believe that if you apply through several calls, you increase your chances of success. It's a simple mathematic uh, uh, calculation. Uh, and also we believe that within this process, you can enrich your organization, enrich your uh, collaboration, uh, potential partnerships, uh, um, and several other uh, things. What we invite you to do here uh, is after this webinar, if you're interested and if uh, it's relevant to you, to you, our business development manager will contact you, ask you to fill a short form. We will gather some information about you, your expertise and uh, ambition. We will also explain you uh, uh, the process. And then if it's relevant, if we see a, a good chance uh, of uh, success, we will uh, schedule a meeting with an analyst in order to accurately se select your funding strategy and apply it. Okay, well, um, I hope you enjoyed and that it was fruitful uh, for you. And I hope that we will uh, discuss shortly. So again, uh, Modelia, thank you and have a nice day. Bye-bye.